credit to Bit. You gotta give credit to Navi. Even though right now they're struggling massively, they're not playing the best brand of Counter Strike. Still able to get the win. Still able to get the W. And at the end of the day, James, that's what matters. There we have it. Do you hear me? Yes, we yeah, do hear you. Hello, guys. First of all, Sasha, congratulations on getting the win. That that certainly wasn't easy. And you guys on Nuke at the end there, it was a constant struggle despite being so far ahead. What what was it feeling like for you? Uh, we didn't uh, play one map ancient for one month because we had some roster changes and mm -hmm. we should have practiced another new maps. And overall, I think we we played bad today, but uh, it was just uh, frustrated the way how we played on uh, second map and especially like we lost two eco rounds yeah. full eco rounds on uh, two maps on nuke and somewhere else so yeah it was a tough game how is this all feeling for you right now because obviously you've got mpl swapping in you've, you've done this before back when it was bit first coming to the team it seems also like you you do a lot of talking with mpl at the same time can you just explain to me how this is working yeah just uh, a lot of amount of work <laughs> to do again you know so for example on practice uh, the way that NPL <laughs> played uh, <laughs> the way how he played. He played much better here. He had some nerves, but still uh, he did a really great job. Finally, we can congrats him with first victory. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Sasha, it feels like whenever you're playing heroic, it's always a, a close game and always back and forth. What is it in their play style that annoys you guys when you're playing them? I think uh, they're like puppet masters sometimes. Okay. It feels like this because they're trying to find gap and when you miss this gap, you try, you're going back, they're already in this gap. Okay. You have another gap there, there as well. That's, I mean, it felt how we played against them on Ancient. Like, every time they could easily, easily fake us. Okay. Where do you put yourselves as a team right now? Because like you mentioned, you haven't done a lot of work, there's these changes going on. Does this still feel like a tournament you guys can win? Yeah, I think so. I mean, Navi is a uh, known team to get better form during the tournament. But it's, of course, it's going to be hard with this, those all teams, but still, I mean, I I think we are like top five, top ten, from top five to top ten right now. But okay. we could play much, much better, I know this. Sasha, how are you feeling individually? It's been a, a very long year, it's been an exhausting year as well for, for many reasons. You're coming into the last tournament of the year now. Are you feeling ready to, to give it a final go or are you looking forward to the holidays? Yeah, I was uh, I was ready before, <laughs> before <laughs> yesterday game, so now I don't know. I mean, uh, yeah, I'm feeling okay, but uh, first of all, it's important as a team because when I have confidence in my team, I just think only about my role. Yeah. And uh, yeah, nothing can disrupt me. Yeah. Okay. Well, a lot of insight. Distract me, distract me sorry. Yeah, okay. <laughs> a lot of insight there, Sasha. Thank you very much for that. I've got one final question for you, though, from the Blast TV viewers. And it says if you could have a superpower, any superpower, what would you be? I would just see through the wall and get all <laughs> tournaments. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Simple once wall hack, you know, why not? Sasha, thank you very much thank for you your guys. time. Thank we'll you. continue to move things forward because that is heroic gone. This is Group B. And